The first thing I did was the national standard instructor training with Bike Right. That was a four day course. We just broke down the national standard, looking at how to pedal, how to do manoeuvres, road positioning, um, starting and finishing a journey, how to manage traffic. We also talked about how to teach people to learn to ride, so from complete beginners, with lots of practice on each other and lots of feedback from the tutors. The thing I'll always say is, so I've been cycling my whole life, cycled to school, cycled to work, cycled all the way around the world, stuff like that, but I learned something as a cyclist and it's made me a safer cyclist having done the instructing, instruction course. So since doing the course, I've been doing some work for Bike Right, so teaching cycling. We had one chap come, he was probably, I don't know, in his late 40s, 50, quite sporty, never ridden a bike before though, and within an hour he was learning, he was cycling around the tennis courts. And then equally somebody else on Learn to Ride, and you're wondering if they were going to really manage it, but with a bit of patience and... Uh, input from all the instructors, you see that person cycling and then progressing on to level one and then hopefully maybe level two in the future. Now I'm starting to see people who started off at Learn to Ride and are now on level two and are starting to cycle more, bought their own bike, came to a doctor bike, had it fixed, riding around to work and to the shops. I work for Bike Right, teaching adults, you know, as a cycling instructor. I have some bikeability work with Birmingham City Council. I am um, yeah, a triathlon coach, do some outdoor education. The cycle instruction has really made it possible to kind of be self-employed and be my own boss.